Hello guys, Soft Tony here and in today's tutorial we're gonna be creating stunning luxury block backgrounds here in After Effects. This elegant and modern design is ideal for a variety of projects and the best part, no plugins are required. So if you haven't already, subscribe to my channel, hit that like button and let's dive straight into After Effects to bring this sophisticated animation to life. Alright, we're here in After Effects and as always let's first create new composition, hit here or on this little icon and as usual this is gonna be final 1920 by 1080 30 fps 10 seconds long. Hit ok and now let's create background, go right click to create new solid layer and I will just hit BG for background, also full HD and then hit ok. Now let's go here in the effects and presets and if you can't find it just go window and you will find effects and presets here. For the first effect let's find fractal noise effect, this one drag and drop onto the background solid layer and here let's make further adjustments, for the fractal type change from basic go to dynamic progressive, alright and also for the noise type change here to block. Let's leave it contrast and brightness as it is, ok, lower down complexity from 6 to 1 and now let's also open up transform options. For the scale I will do 300, you can also play around here with those parameters and also for the rotation let's type 45. Now let's also animate evolution, hold alt on your keyboard and then left mouse click, I will type time, asterisk 50, ok, and now when we hit 0 here inside the final composition, we have this cool looking animation. And also for our next effect, go here again in the effects and preset, I will go triton effect, drag and drop onto the background solid layer, and for the midtones let's also change to pure black color, something like this, ok, and for the highlights I will do maybe this type of grey color. Now hit ok and for the next effect go here and find levels effect, this one drag and drop above triton effect and here inside this levels effect here on the left side are dark parts of our animation and here are bright parts and you can also play around here with levels effect like so but I will leave it as it is. Alright our next step is to duplicate this background solid layer hit ctrl plus d or go edit and then duplicate, select this first background solid layer and also go here in the effects and preset and I will type find edges effect, drag and drop on the first solid layer, ok. And basically you can play around here with the find edges effect, hit here invert option. And now as you can see we have this type of great looking rectangles background, ok. I will just play around with the blending modes and this effect furthermore, ok. You can here change blending mode from normal to add. And now we have this type of look, ok. And also let's change inside the triton effect, I will go and find maybe this orange color and also for the midtones go and find orange color or pick whatever color you want here. And also I will hit T for the opacity, maybe this is too strong, I will go maybe to around 30% and now when we hit 0 we have this great looking background inside the final composition. In every moment you can go here in the background go here in the fractal noise effect and just play around with the shapes. I will go here for the fractal type from this dynamic progressive to max and now we have this great looking effect. Hit T once again, you can play around with the opacity, maybe to go to around 45 or 50 and let's hit 0 again and this is looking great. Alright guys, you can add here more shapes, you can also play around with different types here of the animation, everything is pretty much here up to you. And that was it for today's tutorial and also if you haven't subscribed to my channel hit that subscribe button and if you found this video helpful like always hit that like button and also take a look at my channel for even more great tutorials and until next time stay creative and bye bye.